Hello you guys, good morning or whenever you're watching this, but today I am showing you my morning skincare routine. So I am a person with really, really dry skin and I live in a very, very dry climate as well. Very cold, windy, dry climate. I live in Wyoming and I have the driest skin on the planet. So today I'm gonna to show you my skincare. Just a really, really quick go over of my morning skincare. First, I am starting with the e.l.f. Pure Skin Cleanser. I love this line from e.l.f. e.l.f. is one of those secret, awesome, brands for affordable skincare. Um, I do kind of read the labels on everything, so there's some things that I do avoid from them, but I love this Pure Skin line. I use the cleanser, toner, and moisturizer, so I'm going to go in with that on dry skin, rub it in for about 60 seconds, and then rinse it off with lukewarm water. And while my hands and face are perfectly clean, I throw in my contacts really quick. Then I'm gonna go in with that Pure Skin Toner. This, on just on my bare hands, and I just slap that right on my face. And this is just a really nice hydrating line. It has oat milk, it has very soothing, simple products, no fragrance, I mean simple ingredients, no fragrance. And it has niacinamide, which is also very nice and soothing and healing for the skin. So then I'm also using the Good Molecules Hyaluronic acid boosting essence boosting essence this is the newest thing to my skincare routine you definitely don't need to have like two of these liquid type of steps the toner by itself is just fine but i have extraordinarily dry skin and i love to add these lighter layers of moisture if i can i don't want anything too goopy on my skin so i like to add this in and I put these both on with just my bare hands. Then while my skin is still wet, that is very, very important for hyaluronic acid, I'm going in with one full syringe of the Good Molecules Hyaluronic Acid all over wet skin. I cannot stress that enough. You don't even have to have it wet with toner. It can be any type of facial spray or even just water. As long as your face is wet, your hyaluronic acid is actually going to work. It holds 1,000 times its weight in water or moisture or whatever, so you need your skin to be wet for it to actually work its best and hold that moisture on your skin. Right on top of that, I go in with the Innisfree Intense Hydrating Serum with green tea seed. This is another kind of extra step. You definitely don't need a serum in the morning if you don't want one. I just like it and I love how this stuff all together makes my skin feel and how hydrated but not sticky everything is. After that, I'll be using the e.l.f. Pure Skin moisturizer that comes with this line and as you can see it has like this really intense creamy whiteness to it it takes an extra little second to soak into the skin but once it does again it's not sticky not thick not any of those things i would not like it or recommend it if it was any of those things so you just need that extra like 30 seconds to rub it in and then you are totally good to go it is not sticky at all then for my morning eye cream i use the pericomb md cold plasma plus eye this is just something I got in a FabFitFun. You definitely do not need an eye cream that is this expensive. I kind of think that all hydrating eye creams are pretty much the same, unless you're getting an eye cream with something very, very specific in it, like caffeine or vitamin C or something like that. If it's just purely for hydration, they're pretty much all the same. You do not need this extremely expensive eye cream. Um, I think that the Fourth Ray Beauty one that I've been using for a long time before this is just as good, and it's $14. I do have quite the stash of sheet masks and I tend to not do sheet masks during the weekday I stick to my eye patches I really love the pixie detoxify caffeine eye mask and I also love the fourth ray beauty eye mask I tend to use these more on the weekday because I can kind of do stuff without fearing that they're going to fall off and the sheet masks I will do at night or on the weekend that cover the full face and I completely forgot to film me putting on sunscreen because I usually put it on right before I leave the house not right at the beginning of my skincare currently using the Tula probiotic sunscreen for the face and I use the Alba sheer mineral SPF for my body so yeah that is my full morning skincare routine so thank you guys so much for watching all my socials are listed down below along with all the products that I used in this video and I will see you guys in another video very soon. Bye!